Okay, just another quick video here. This is my 67 Chevy. It's a C10 long bed. It's all beat up. It's pretty much an old farm truck. Let's see if we can get in here and fire this thing up. You see, I, I don't do anything with it at all. The bed, the cab. Let's get in here and see if we can't start this thing and see how much crap I've got in here this would be good notice my heater controls are all busted but that's okay all right let's try to fire this thing up This one's pretty strong. I don't know, maybe like 400 horsepower probably. It, it's definitely strong, it runs pretty good. Let's pop this hood and look and see what we got in there. Like I said, it's an old beat up truck. <clears throat> I don't hardly ever wash it, but there's that one, <clears throat> and walk around here to the front, the door, I'm going to pull some keys out here. Shut that one off. Let's walk up here and look at the old 79. And this one is my old 79. It's a it's my trail truck. It's the one I take out. Whenever we go in the woods, I just absolutely love four-wheeling. Let's get in here and See if we can start this one up. This one was a really nice truck when I got it, but you know, if you can't drive them and use them, and they're pretty much worthless. Let's see if we can start this one up here. Sorry for the camera, folks. It runs pretty good. On this one, I pretty much pulled the transmission and transfer case out, put a small RV cam in the motor engine, actually, and it had a 203 transfer case in it and I put a 205 gear to gear transfer case new drive lines new mounts rebuilt the front end and rear end and now it's trail worthy this thing will go just about anywhere you want to and that's that's pretty much it you all have a wonderful day and i will see you on the next go round hit like subscribe and all that stuff have a good day